All right, today I want to do a little tutorial on how to troubleshoot a condenser fan motor. This came off a Goodman heat pump, and it's just three wires, black, purple, and brown. Your purple will be on the common on the capacitor, and the brown will be on the fan, and your black wire will be coming off the defrost board, off the DF2 there. So you want to pull the wires, then we ohm it out. Pull the black off the DF2. This will be mounted onto the to the condensing unit obviously but we're just doing a test run today all right we got the meter set to ohms put on the little horseshoe there to the horseshoe all right the first thing we'll do is take our black wire that came off the defrost board put it in your meter lead and then grab the purple wire that came off the capacitor and see how many ohms we got Give it a few seconds. Looks like we're going to hang around 63.8. Oh, there we go. All right, we'll say 63.7. So I'll write it down BL and P 63.7. Just want to write it down on my little notepad there. All right, you can leave the, the black in, pull the purple off the red, and then put the brown in. The brown wire that came off the capacitor, that'll be your, your start winding for your fan. So like we got 48 point, point 0.1, BL and brown. 48.1 now these two numbers here we'll need to add up to our purple and brown wires so you can leave leave the brown on the red lead pull the black off and stick the purple on So we're looking at about 111.8.9. It's bouncing around. So. One eleven point nine point eight. All right, so you take your two numbers, the black and purple, 63.7, black and brown, 48.1, and it equals 111.8. Our purple and brown wire together ohmed out at 11.8, so this fan motor is good. Yeah, so if they didn't add up to 111, then you would have a bad fan motor and would need to switch it out. And that's how you ohm out a fan motor. This is for a condenser heat pump, but you can pretty much do them all this way. All right, I hope this helps. Thank you for watching The Dirty Maintenance Show.